welcome back to the channel. This is Jay. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul. I found a couple of things at my, one thing at my um, local Goodwill that I thought was a good find. And I have a item that I got from Amazon. So I'm going to get right into it because I got a few things. So I went to the Dollar Tree and there were these boxes. I love these boxes to store things in. And these ones were Halloween. And they look like books and they had two sizes. It's really three sizes, but I was only able to find two of them. So I got the two that I could find and they fit inside each other. And I got to figure out what I want to do with them, but I know I got a plan for them. The next thing I found was these are considered hair cuffs, but I'm going to reimagine them because I've been making, um, I've been making, um, these, I've been making, um, puffs and I've been making, um, dangles. So I figure somehow, cause they open, I can use these when I'm making my dangles. So I'm gonna use these. And I was asked by one of my subscribers, how do I make these, how the fluffy dangle? And this one's made with, um, I'll show you at the end how, how what, the, what the ribbon is that makes it. And it comes from the Dollar Tree also. So I'll show you in the end what that is. So I got those. And then I thought about these also to be used in making dangles or making something like that because they already have a dangling on it. I just got to figure out how do I incorporate it. So I got the silver one and I got the gold one. And the gold one comes with these leaves on it. So I'm thinking this is going to be a really good deal and this is going to be fun and I'm going to work on that this weekend. So I'll probably do a craft with me and you can see what I did. I was able to find the cups that they have there. So I found the one with all the leaves on it. And this one's really pretty. And I use these things a lot. I, I, I use them a lot. And I found the one with the bicycles and had the blessed on it. So I love these things and I use them a lot. So I like them, the blessed and the, of those guys. Um, next thing I found was I'm working on my um, Julie Nutting doll because I'm in a, um, in a in a swap where we make our Julie Nutting doll. It's called a Year of Julie Nutting Dolls. And so I'm going to make my doll into a witch. And so I found the witch's hats and I found the broom and I found this cat. That I'm going to try to make into the black cat. So I'll probably take it off there. But I'm going to, I have to work on my doll tomorrow. So she's going to be a witch. And these are all her witch accoutrements. Um, I'm also going to, um, I needed some more of these leaves and foliages. A friend of mine, Ruth, she made a, um, a um, wreath that was made a la, it's like a doll's head. It's like a, a cut out of a doll's head. And I'm going to get one of those and I want to make one. And so I needed more foliage. And I got some, uh, and I have some foliage that's left from the last time. So I got three of those. That's 50 pieces in it. So I'm hoping 150 pieces that I'll have enough for that. I found this little um, ornament. And it's an ornament, it screws off, and you can put a scene in it. And I've always wanted to do it. It's a DIY ornament, and they're with the Crafter Square. They only had one, so I took that one. Another thing I want to work on with my Julie Nutting Dolls, I was thinking that I, I want to make one of my dolls into an angel. And so I want to use these wings i don't want the thing i just want the wings and i'm thinking it's going to come out pretty cool when i finish with it and i got the yellow ribbon to go with it because i want to make her dress 
with this ribbon and have that. I was going to make that my doll for this time, but I'm going to figure out how I can incorporate it next time for um, November. But I'm going to make my doll into a um, uh, uh, angel with those wings. The Crafter Squares, I, they have all pastels. Who knew? So I've never seen these before. And you get 12 colors. Oop, didn't mean to tear it. You get 12 colors of the all pastels. And they look like that. That's not bad. Nice colors, too. So I got picked that up. It's not bad for a dollar. I haven't used them yet. I have other pastels, but I've never, I haven't used these yet. And I haven't decided if I was going to keep them or if I'm going to give them away to my friend. Um, needed some sticky notes. Pick those up. Um, let's see. I got, oh, I got some black ribbon and I got black ribbon. Because I don't, in my, um, with my doll, I'm going to need to tie the ribbon on. So I got black ribbon. I got these, um... Decorative bowls, spooky bowls. I just got them because I like them. I have nothing to do with them, but I like the color of them. But that means I got to find something now because you can't buy crafts and don't do anything with them. So I got those. Um, I bought a picture. I bought this picture frame. Um, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm redoing my living room into a coastal-like theme because I like blues and whites. And so I have a, a, a picture that's in a frame and it's green. So I want to change it to a white frame. So I picked that up. I think I'm going to need another one, but I picked that up. Boy, so I got that. Um, I got these window decorations, but I usually use these in my planner. So I got these for my planner. I'm not a Halloween person, but I like these guys. I thought they were cute. And plus they're, you know, fluffy and fat. So I'm going to use them in my planner. What else did I get? Oh, I found this frame that I want to use here in my craft room. And I want to um, be able to hang stuff on it, reminders and stuff like that. And I just like the way it looks. And so I'll probably use it for that. Or I may um, take this part out and make a um, box with... Julie Nutting or something like that. But so far, I want it just for my craft room to add stuff. What else did I find? I found another pack of the pearls. So I got those. I got this Real Techniques sponge. And um, it's for your face. But... I may, I think I may use it in my craft room. So I may use it when I'm spreading um, inks. So I think that's what I got it from. If it works for my inks, then I'll probably go back and pick up another one for my face. So I got that. Um, last, the last thing I found, the last thing I got was they had these threads. So I got the sewing threads because I'm, you know, can sew stuff, do whatever you want to do with it. But it had these and I got them. So I need those for my sewing box. And then from Amazon, I finally got my, got the Memory Dex hole punch from Heidi Swap. So I'm going to be doing um, a few Memory Dex cards. And I want to, um, and I want to talk with um, some of the ladies that have a small channel and see if I can get them to do some swapping with me. So I got that. What else did I find? Oh, and at my local um, Goodwill, I found these rings for your planners. And it was $1.99. It was $1.99. And it came with, let's have it over here. It came with these large expander rings, and it got the turquoise ones. Came with two turquoise ones, and a pink one, and a pink one. And it also came with a book cover that somebody put in there. It should have been ninety nine cent, but they didn't. They stuck it in this bag, so it's a scratchy book cover. So I'll be able to use that. So. That's my haul, but I wanted to show about, hold on for a second, and I'll show you how I made that, if I can find my,
when you go to the um when you go to the dollar store they have this um yarns and i just use the yarn the same way i do to make any tassel i uh, because it's all fluffy like this as you continue to wrap it around your hand it becomes more fluffier so it's a fluffy it becomes a fluffy tassel and then you kind of tie it off in your tassel way cut that off and that's how you make it so if you have this fluffy kind you can go to crafter square um, at the dollar store look for this it's probably in the section where the yarn is and they usually it's one of those things that we all crafters loved and we all got some um, if you if you go to the store and you can't find it let me know and this is more than enough i'd gladly share it with you so if you want me to share if you don't find it and you need me to share i gladly share it. you just have to um, um send me a message and and with your um mailing instructions and i'll share and you know who you are i don't want to say you on say your name on the video but if you if you don't find it let me know and i'll share some of this with you and that's how i made this So thank you for tuning in today. I've been um, spending time just trying to um, get stuff done and I'll have another video for you. I was making my um, some tassels with um, ribbons and I wanted to share those. And so I'll do that. And I'm also putting in the tassels. I wanted, I wanted to do one with a flashlight and of course one with a um, charging cord. So I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for tuning in. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you like what I'm doing here on the channel, come on, stop by and subscribe. And I appreciate you and thank you. And I'll talk to you soon in the next video. And don't forget, always be the person who makes somebody else smile. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.